بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله Hi everyone uh, Today in this lab or in this tutorial we will continue using Alice um, Every time you start Alice you will start with this dialog box um, and you will have uh, multiple options you have blank slates uh, starters my project recent and file system to start um, a new uh, project you can select one of these uh, backgrounds or environments to start with or you can start with starters and pick one of these ready-made uh, starters or you can go to my project and you will see all of your projects listed in this space or go to the recent the, the projects that have been opened uh, recently and finally file system this will allow you to browse to your file system and select what uh, project file do you want to open to work with either you can select one of these or you can go back and select one uh, of these backgrounds um, I will start with desert desert ok and then uh, as we mentioned last time there are two views for uh, using Alice one is setup scene and the other is edit code now we are in the setup scene بالإضافة والتعديل للكاركترز للشخصيات الموجودة على على ال أو على العمل أو على المشروع project now I can go to all classes select Alice for example drag and drop Alice select which type of Alice you, do you want to insert in your project and also you can give it a name for example uh, Alice 1 ok ok and here Alice has been added to the uh, work space also again you can go and select for example a camel and drag it uh, to your project here is the camel as you can see here the uh, those curves and the circle is for rotation character راح نمر عليهن كلهن إن شاء الله نشوفهن عملية التدوير rotation um, by now I have two characters on my uh, project um, let, let's, let's go over uh, the options here here you get for example default the default اللي هو الوضع العادي default um, you can select every time by the mouse you can select what character do you want to work with camel or alice the rotation عملية تدوير here you got three options you got one the blue one the blue line you can click on the blue line and uh, sorry uh, and move it to here sorry 
let's start with the circle. With the circle, you can click on the circle, move it right or left. You can use 360 degrees to rotate. Every time you think that you did a mistake, use this button here, undo. Zer, <coughs> zer taraja, uh, li ay khatwa, uh, sawetuha, undo. Fi al muqabal, redo, yitam tamfid nafs al khatwa. بس دائما نستخدم ان دو فاي خطوة انت سويتها تريد تراجع عنها اعمل ان دو او من لوحة المفاتيح كنترول زد لوحة المفاتيح كنترول زد مع بعض now let's use the the white line this is another rotation to the left and to the right also use undo to get your previous uh, position the blue line to the back and to the front uh, these are three different types of rotation uh, move when you click move you will find three arrows one in the top one in the bottom one in the right side you can click on of these you can move it up you can move it to the front you can move it to the side right and left you can uh, move it until the character is being hidden you can move it up uh, anytime use undo to get your previous um, position resize resize also can be used to uh, decrease or increase the size of the character زيادة حجم الكاركتر increase it or decrease it click this arrow to increase and decrease the size of the uh, character also I, I'm using undo just to show you uh, all of these different options that you can use with your character how about the camel you can do the same you can decrease the size of the camel and increase the size um, move I can move the camel every time just put it on the de default pull, um, uh, default icon so that can you uh, you can work on the other options um, also here from here you can change the selection of the character that you would like to work on and now just work on the camel uh, here I got some procedures procedures uh, for example I can use one of these for example turn then um, right then the degree point to five as you can see the um, the direction or uh, the camel turn itself to uh, another direction to the to the right uh, direction if you'd like to get your uh, previous position and do again this is just to show you that you can control the position also from here um, also you can change the paint 
and you will get different colors and the opacity opacity here درجه التعتيم لما نقول درجه التعتيم اذا خليناها زيرو راح يختفي الكمل ليش درجة التعتيم أصبحت صفر بالإمكان تخلوها one or you can select one between يعني شبه مخفي شبه معتم في حالة أنك نقلت الكمل خليته أمام أي كاركتر آخر راح تشوف من وراء الكاركتر من وراء الكمل ورا الجمل في تشوف منه لان درجه التعتيم ليست 100% في هذه الحاله معنا الحين 20% في المية فقط undo and set the opacity to 1 here also the um, the vehicle every time we need to use this for all of our characters and also here the position uh, we got x y and z uh, when you move uh, any character see all values for three positions uh, coordinates are changing Also, the size, width, height, and depth. You can uh, you can change these values to accommodate uh, your goal and objective in your project. Um, we can add more characters by going to all classes, and then. Um, is a flyer or prop? Yeah, from prop classes, and we can add, um, for example, this tree here. Add it somewhere in the back, and add some little bushes. Um, one is here and add another one here okay and add some in the back uh, again okay the name notice the name will be changed and giving numbers the same name and the number based on how many instances um, that are used by um, or by the project of this uh, character um, for example if this is very big you can reduce the size you can resize it also this one here you can resize it another one resize it and also let's have uh, another character this temple here in the back um, let's take one of these yeah here okay and as you can see the size is very big um, sorry I can resize it I need just to see where is the upper arrow so I can resize it 
um, you to resize it you need to click on the character and drag down as you can see here now uh, it has been resized يعني اضغط على الكاركتر واسحب بالماوس خليك ضغط واسحب على تحت للتصغير اسحب على فوق للتكبير um, we can also move it a little bit here and um, also here we got starting camera view different views this is the default one starting camera view and layout scene view this is from the top as you can see here from the top also you can see all characters you can use the mouse to change the the view also there are uh, top view and side view where you can see the camel alice and those um, uh, bushes the front view to give you um, um, uh, front angle to see all characters uh, still we have the temple not showing let's use starting camera view and here uh, as you can see here three uh, icons with arrows these that you can use for different purposes let's start with the first one uh, this is the tilt um, uh, backward and forward this is um, back uh, forward and this is backward maybe I can use one step here also here you can use this to get closer to the characters to get away from the characters now we are talking about the camera uh, left and right to move the camera left and right also here different one to get you a different uh, angle for the view left and right you can work uh, around all of these just to uh, check them practice them to see uh, which one uh, that will help you in your future project using Alice um, remember that we are in the setup view where we can add characters and change the scene as you can see here we got all characters كل الشخصيات listed um, in our project um, let's move to the edit code now here we can add more events more actions to our project um, where we can add all of this in my first method we uh, did uh, this last time and we will do it again here uh, these are the codes but every time to add a code you have to select the character that you would like to add the code لازم هذا مهم أنك تختار الكاركتر اللي تريد تطبق عليه الكود for example let's start with Alice and with Alice now we will try to move the shoulder in the shoulder we got 
as you can see here, uh, when you select Alice, uh, take go through this um, menu, go to get left shoulder, then get left shoulder, we will pick turn, turn to right and uh, the degree or the amount is 0.25 next now get the other one Alice also here Alice uh, click on this icon or just move the mouse over and get right shoulder and turn use turn again turn to the left 0.25 let's uh, let us run the program and see how it works click on run Sorry, I'll bring that from my other screen here. Restart again. As you can see, the uh, or Alice is moving her arms, starting with left arm, then the right arm um, to the amount that we have specified. Um, let's add another one um, Alice the left let's use Alice get left shoulder and use this time use roll roll to the left uh, 0.25 and see how it works click run now another movement um, Alice is doing by adding uh, this um, code now how about if I drag this between two turns so turn left shoulder turn right then left shoulder roll left then right shoulder turn left try the program see the order now the order of the code is very important uh, make sure that you do the right you follow the right order uh, in your program to do a certain task now let's move to um, moving the uh, the feet again Alice um, get left hip turn background here left have this one to move it back round uh, one two five the first amount the first value of the amount and run the program notice the feet Alice is moving um, her feet uh, uh, up again restart notice the movement here on the feet now go to how about uh, to get everything uh, ready or 
after moving all of these parts of the body, get everything um, to the initial situation. Ilal hal al ula. Don harakat. Alice, go down. Uh, this is the code. Straight, straighten out joints and move it here run the program now it's moving and um, now she is putting everything back to the initial situation where she started close the view then let's add something else yeah I, I i forgot one thing i forgot one important thing uh, here in this program or in all programs that we are doing we have to focus on the save save the file every time you create a new one for example i will call this project one and save it in your folder save every time you make sure that you save your work don't work too much then you may uh, lose all of your works because you haven't saved your file um, let's add another go to the setup scene and add another character here eagle I, I I will add this eagle okay this is a new character is being added to my program and um, when you go to the edit code and now the selection on eagle uh, if you drop down you will find some codes these codes are uh, special codes for this character يعني بعض الاحيان راح نحصل بعض الكود خاص لبعض الشخصيات ما ممكن نشوف يعني هذا الكود في عند اليس يعني مخصص في البرنامج في أليس برنامج أليس للعمل مع شخصيات محددة. For example, let's do this. Spread wings. يعني ينفش يجناحه. بعدين fold wings. يعني بعد ما ينفذ كل الأوامر الأولى على أليس. بعدين ينتقل إلى الإيجل وينفذ الأمرين spread wings and fold wings uh, click run to see the result did you see uh, the eagle is spreading wings then folding uh, wings again restart You can see also uh, some other code that are uh, designed only for some uh, specific characters, not for all characters. Um, what I would like to mention here, uh, comments, can you see here, sorry, comments, you can drag this comments. For example, here, this comment um, helps the programmer to know every part of the uh, program. ملاحظة تم كتابتها عن طريق المبرمج لمعرفة ما هو قادم من الأسطر البرمجية. For example, I placed uh, the comment code here. I can 
uh, for example, at eagle that is it. Uh, this will show the program that the following code uh, is related to the eagle. I can also add another one uh, here at the top uh, Alice to show that the coming code for Alice and so on. You can use this uh, for every part of your program uh, to indicate what is the following uh, code uh, is. الملاحظات تساعد المبرمج أو أي مبرمج آخر لما يجي في المستقبل الملاحظات هذه اللي تكتب ما يتم تنفيذها في البرنامج العكس فقط تكون محفوظة داخل النص البرمجي تساعد المبرمج أو غير من المبرمجين لما يجوا في المستقبل يشوفوا تقسيم البرنامج أي ملاحظات وضحها المبرمج الأول المبرمج التالي راح يفهم عملية تفاصيل البرنامج أي ملاحظات أدخلها المبرمج الأول أي مبرمج أيضا يقدر يضيف ملاحظات تفيد أي شخص يدخل للتصميم ويشوف البرنامج من الداخل الملاحظة الملاحظات في البرمجة لا يتم تنفيذها فقط هي تبقى ملاحظات في الكود um, Also I would like to draw your attention that uh, with every character there are different uh, uh, sub parts سموها sub parts for example this uh, camera الكاميرا فيها two parts uh, Alice as you can see here multiple parts camel as well and as you can see here all of these uh, trees and bushes as well as the temple don't have sub parts ما في اجزاء تتحرك فيها ما في اي كود اضافي ممكن نحرك فيها الاجزاء في هذه الكاركترز and uh, eagle yes sorry for that this is my digital assistant um, eagle uh, also has all of these sub parts and you can check any part if you cannot find an arrow here this means there are no sub parts you cannot move you cannot control the movement of that character now save your work save it and start a new project new program um, let's do for example select one of these um, grassy desert okay um, let's go to the setup scene to add some characters go to all classes piped classes then um, new um, adult or select one of these yeah let's take this one new adult and put it here um, as you can see here there are too many options to select your character or to customize your character uh, for example uh, here adult uh, let's take male and select what you would like to see oh, oh, uh, wearing all of these costumes let's take this one scroll down it's uh, top and bottom 
you can select one of these uh, hair and hat um, let's take this one and the face take another one select ok adult person this is the name of our character click ok wait some time for the character to be added to your uh, to your uh, program here I got the character and I can work as we mentioned with all of these options to customize the rotation movement tahrik, resize the size of the character we will go to the edit code and start with this character adult person and start with get right shoulder get right shoulder uh, turn to the right to the right one two five then next get left shoulder so you have to go back again get left um, shoulder this one also to the uh, use turn turn to the right one point one two five then next get right hip adult person get right hip um get right hip then uh, select turn backward backward and the amount is um, 0 0.08 so uh, I can use custom decimal number and have 0 0.08 ok then get left help left where is left help yeah this one left help and also use turn but this time forward and the amount also the same custom decimal number 0 uh, 0.08 ok then um, I need to use move this is from the default one um, move and the direction direction forward should be forward and the point five um, I need to do all of these uh, inside um, wh what it's called do together from the bottom use do uh, 
uh, together. I can drop all of these my, my code inside, move it inside, turn, and the la the last one is here. Get right shoulder, left shoulder, right hip, and left hip, then move. All of these, as you can see now, uh, they are all inside one box called do together. Um, let's have another do together here and use move forward again forward point five then the last code here an uh, adult person straighten out joints to put everything back to the previous or to the initial situation then another two another do together or um, so far let's save our work and it's on P1 should be p1 the same file name uh, let's try uh, this one run restart now the character is walking by following um, these two uh, groups of codes close this and continue writing uh, or adding some codes um, get right shoulder we need to use get right shoulder um, turn to the left point one two five then get left shoulder left shoulder to the turn to the left one two five point one two five again get right hip get right hip forward using turn forward uh, point zero eight another one get left hip this one here use turn to the backward backward uh, point zero eight point zero eight okay um, then move forward select adult person and use move forward amount of zero five sorry point five point five then um, get left knee this time this is a new one get left knee the rakba um, turn use turn forward point point zero zero eight 
0.08 okay now let's try uh, this part run it's moving forward moving the knee again restart let's complete the code um, I need to use uh, do together again one more box do together um, I need to use move using move from adult person move direction to forward point five then next um, go down and select straighten out joints put everything back then also you can add turn um, left this is outside do together left point two five then again you can use one of these for example to so say hello or any custom uh, text uh, use run to see how it works maybe we can change the direction to the right and the, this to 1.25 let's try again Uh, you can customize this code you can customize it and you can add different code try them see them every time you can uh, delete the code um, you can uh, use undo to uh, delete your previous uh, uh, step of inserting the code and you can customize it you can add more code uh, uh, get yourself familiar with this don't forget at the end to save save your work and um, uh, i'll see you next uh, lecture next tutorial using alice uh, till then uh, thank you